All right, you guys got everything ready to go? Get started on. Oh, I got boiled now. Got eight going down. You got six out there. The three other ones open. My name is Nathan Roby. I'm chef and owner of Simple Twist, and we serve new American cuisine. My wife and I were in a prior business, prior restaurant that we owned. Things kind of went sideways, and it was just a simple twist of fate that things worked out the way they did. And now we are uh, owners of two successful restaurants. It turned out to be the best thing that ever happened to us. One of my rules in the kitchen is, would you eat that? I do not let my staff sell anything to my guests that they would eat themselves. In the summertime, all my tomatoes are grown locally. Um, we use local collards, local kale, anything that's coming out of the farmer's gardens, I try to have them bring to me. And as a chef, it creates some new challenges for me to come up with new dishes utilizing what I have. The biggest thing that we can do as chefs is expose the customers to the local products that our farmers are able to produce. We're an agrarian culture and we always have been in this county. We have a ton of family owned farms. It's important for us to be able to provide visitors with an experience where they can go to a restaurant and actually eat something and then go to the farm that their food was grown on. Because I don't think that you're a true foodie until you've actually met the farmer who grew the food that you're eating. People that are consuming food, they very much want to know and understand their food. They want to have sort of a personal relationship in some cases with the farmer that grew it. They want to feel a connection to that land and to the farm. My granddad bought this farm back in the 50s and it was a tobacco farm and that's where my dad and his brothers grew up and they worked on the farm. And once my dad graduated college, he came back here and, and slowly transformed it from a tobacco farm to a nursery. And then about 20 years ago, we started strawberries. And we diversified from strawberries into blueberries, pumpkins. Most recently, we've started greenhouse tomatoes. I enjoy being outside, and I enjoy the freedoms that farming allows. It's not like a, a office job where you're sitting in a cubicle. It's very easy to see in real time, in real life, what I did that day. I can physically see the field of plants that I planted. It energizes you, I think, having people out here, especially young people and stuff, and see their enthusiasm and everything at the farm and for what you're doing. 